been five months. I'm gonna give it to you straight. I'm sorry about the shit past the cost. I was helping one guy that was that got affected, that was hurt. And you know me. I'm a guy that's in that helps people in need to help support them. Make sure they're doing well. So I helped him. I helped that guy through his hard times. I tried to get him back on his feet. I tried getting him back to what he used to be. Shit didn't work out. So then there's a fight. A fight that got me too mad. Which ended us both getting kicked in the face. And then I checked back. I was speechless. I didn't know what was rolling, rolling through my mind when I went back in. Let's say hello and what's up. I thought it was all over, you know. All hopes were lost. So then I got mad. This uncontrolling anger. This, this uncontrolling anger got me to who I am today. Currently. My anger got me thrown out of the family I was in. Not my real life family, but you know what I'm talking about. I backstabbed. I didn't mean to backstab, but I backstabbed. It got worse. My anger got worse. It was because of my anger. I got too mad. I couldn't control myself. And it just got to me. So then I backstabbed. I gathered all the information I could. Went to the court. Put out a trial. And I got him. And I thought that was the worst choice of my life. Online, actually. Which got me thrown out. But still, everyone was still welcome. He said I was welcome. So I tried my best to say, let's put this in the past. Never be hurt again. And we both agreed. And that was the last time we basically talked. Online, actually. You know? He was basically a really good friend of mine, and I just fucked it up. <laughs> I'm sorry if I fucked it up. I'm sorry my anger got to me. Dude, my darkest hour. Now today, March 2nd, I feel like nothing changed between us. I just wish I was forgiven from the shit I did. That I fucked up. I dumb fucked up. I just wish I had that second chance. A second chance of never gonna backstab ever again. Never ever gonna give shit to. Even if I was in a bad mood, I will control all my anger. I promise I'll never do anything bad. I'll promise I'll never start any more drama. I feel like I'm lost right now. And the deepest, in the deepest, 
thefts in this world. And I wish I can have it all back. I mean, it's okay if you don't. By all means, I'll move on from now. And we never ever will talk to this, talk about this ever again. I thought what I did was right. But then yet again, deep inside, I thought what I did was wrong. Too regretful. And it was regretful. And all my swearing I did, that was my anger. I promise. I promise that I get that second chance to that good friend out there. Everything would probably just be back to normal, you know, like it was before. Before all this bull crap came to me. Choices. Just, just the choices got to me. It's either this guy or this guy. I would rather stay neutral, but... I chose a side, and I thought I did it right. And I thought I did the right thing helping that one guy. One friend out. And ever since after that, me and that one friend never talked again. But me and my really good friend, I think I just fucked it up. Done being friends, I guess that's the bottom line, right? But I just keep rejecting that feeling of moving on, of just forgetting everything. Humans can't forget. Humans don't forget unless they have Alzheimer's, but humans can't forget, for, you know, forget what they did. They cannot move on from what they did. And that's where I'm at right now. And I wish I had that second chance. Life would be good. Everything would go back to normal like it was. I hope I'm forgiving, but I feel like I'm not forgiven still to this day, March 2nd. Screw the past, ignore the past, move on. But I didn't want to, I just really want to feel into the, I just want to be a part of something that I loved for a year. More than a year, actually. Not more than a year, but it was eight months. I just wish I got that second chance, you know. And whoever I'm talking to, you probably know who. The numbers are 454. And that's... All I know who I'm talking about. That I wish I had a second chance. Bye guys.